Mystery E. coli outbreak in Connecticut, Idaho, Missouri, New Jersey, Ohio, Pennsylvania, and Washington. Illness numbers, Connecticut, 2, Idaho, 4, Missouri, 1, New Jersey, 6, Ohio, 1, Pennsylvania, 2, and Washington, 1, the CDC, several states, the US Food and Drug Administration, and the US Department of Agriculture's Food Safety and Inspection Service are investigating a multi-state outbreak of sugar toxin producing E. coli 0157H7 infections. This investigation includes E. coli 0157H7 infections recently reported by the New Jersey Department of Health. Illnesses reported by investigators in New Jersey also included ill people who had a diagnostic test showing they were infected with E. coli bacteria. Laboratory testing is ongoing to link their illnesses to the outbreak using DNA fingerprinting. Some people may not be included in CDC's case count because no bacterial isolates are available for the DNA fingerprinting needed to link them to the outbreak. As of the 9th of April, 2018, 17 people infected with the outbreak strain of E. coli 0157H7 have been reported from 7 states. The 7 states are, Connecticut, 2, Idaho, 4, Missouri, 1, New Jersey, 6, Ohio, 1, Pennsylvania, 2, and Washington, 1. Illnesses started on dates ranging from the 22nd of March, 2018 to the 31st of March, 2018. Ill people range in age from 12 to 84 years, with a median age of 41. Among ill people, 65% are female. Six ill people have been hospitalized, including one person who developed hemolytic uremic syndrome, a type of kidney failure. No deaths have been reported. The investigation is still ongoing, and a specific food item, grocery store, or restaurant ch Marla Clark, the food safety law firm, is the nation's leading law firm representing victims of E. coli outbreaks and hemolytic uremic syndrome. Huss. The E. coli lawyers of Marla Clark have represented thousands of victims of E. coli and other foodborne illness infections and have recovered over $650 million for clients. Marla Clark is the only law firm in the nation with a practice focused exclusively on foodborne illness litigation. Our E. coli lawyers have litigated E. coli and hus cases stemming from outbreaks traced to ground beef, raw milk, lettuce, spinach, sprouts. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to us on YouTube. If you like donate to us visit home on the page PayPal.